Hello everyone and welcome to another episode on Tyler's Tech. So today I was a little bored and decided to take a look at Remix OS which is an Android based operating system that targets your desktop. Installation was really easy, all I needed was a USB stick with at least 8GB of memory to burn ISO 12 using the included program that came bundled with the download. I then booted off the USB stick and set it to resident mode so it saved all of my apps and any changes I've made directly to the USB stick. Here it's asking me if I want any of these apps installed now and if I want to enable the Google Play Store, which I do so we can download more apps once the installation is finished. Okay, here we are. So it's going to install a few apps that I've chose to install in the background. So while it does that, we'll just have a look at stuff. So over here, you've got your notifications. Screenshot. Auto hide the taskbar. Locations. And do not disturb. Let's turn that on for now. Okay, got your Wi-Fi there. Bluetooth, so this is on a Gigabyte Bricks 1900 which does have Bluetooth, so I wonder if it's found the drivers. It has. Okay, that's not too bad at all. Um, what's this? Memory cleanup. Okay. So if we open the Play Store. Um, I won't back this up. Alright, so we've got the Play Store. So let's just try and install some apps. Uh, WhatsApp. I know you need a number for that. I've got loads of old numbers that I could easily activate that with. It's Instagram. Let's uh, see what the office words like on here with the keyboard and mouse. Right, so yeah, we'll download Word for Android. And we're also going to get uh, Man22 to benchmark it. Just, I'm just curious what this bit bricks benchmarks on an Android system. So we get and two there we go we have to install both of them so we go back and go back into this one right can we make this a smaller window Hold on, let me move my face. This is going for a capture card in my PC at the moment. So no, you can't make it smaller. It's just minimise. Okay. Let's bring me back up. It'd be best to be there. Okay. Right. So I've got a switch so I can switch the inputs over of my mouse and keyboard. Just through the USB, that's what that noise was. Okay, so that's all done. So let's have a look at the file manager. It doesn't look too bad actually. So that can be resized. Can it snap? Hold on. So you can't just pull it down. Does it snap? No, it doesn't seem to snap. That's alright. Okay. Let's close that. So let's have a look at Word. Allow 
of that. We should skip signing in. Let's open a blank document. Oh, we have to. I'm not going to do that. But it works. Okay. So it's Remix Central. I guess it's some apps that they've um, rec recommend. So we should get YouTube. I thought I did download Spotify, but obviously not. Let's try a game with a keyboard and mouse. Oh, what's happened there? Okay. <laughs> I don't really play any Android games on my phone, but I just want to see what it's like on here. Let's open up the settings. Right, so it's just like what you'd see on your phone. It's got a nice little in Ethernet there, so you can use your Ethernet. A wired connection. Storage and USB. About tablet. So it registers it as a tablet. Android 6.0.1. Kernel okay, there. Security patch 2016. Super user. So I think it's rooted. experimental features so you get debug in the terminal okay Google Play Store won't run unless you what was that right we've got to update Google Play services there we go that's doing that I wonder if you can make this a darker colour, the um, the app launcher here, a night mode or something. Let's have a look at backgrounds. Change wallpaper. What's going on with that? Oh, here we go. Is it doing something? No, so it's just random stuff. Okay, so is that done? No, that's still installing. Don't close the desktop we'll wait I think it's because it's got that update going so the YouTube apps a bit rubbish right the YouTube app was rubbish we won't bother using that okay so let's have a look at Netflix I don't actually have any local files on it to play but we'll just have a look So yeah, just a phone version, but you should be able to full screen it and everything else. Yeah, okay. So is that done yet? Um, I guess so. It's just disappeared. Let's open Jetpack Joyride. Full screen. To exit, swipe down from the top. Okay. You just use the mouse. 
This one is, seems to be running alright. Ah, uh, no, we've crashed. Oh! <laughs> okay, that's enough of that. So I want you to swipe it down. Let me close that. Right, I'm just going to run and 2-2 two two, and then I'm going to wrap it up there. So I'm probably going to have to move my face again. Actually, no, we should be able to just get it up here. Okay, let's test. I'm just going to give it permissions. Okay, we'll test that. I'm going to get rid of my face and let that do it on its own. Okay, and we're back, and it's got that, so <laughs> let's have a look. So 3D is not a good score. <laughs> this is a high-end uh, processor, apparently. It's not. Uh, RAM scored only 8 gig RAM. I wonder why it didn't score that well. It must be a slow RAM. Um, well, I think that'll do for now. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.